Because if you're asking me why I'm recording this video, because uh, I was watching like some videos before I go to South Korea, so like I don't know, I felt like it wasn't really enough in those videos, so I wanted to show like how much I can. So these are the things that I bought as a like beauty products and face mask and stuff like that. So yeah, from this bag, which I want to start off with, like I mean, how cute is that? Look at it, it's so cute. This is from Artbox. So I'm gonna start with this one. So this is a gold snail peeling gel. I don't really know why I bought this one to be honest. I mean I know because the woman was insisting a lot. So yeah, I bought it. But uh, it looks okay. Yeah, it's, it's like a peeling, you know. I mean, this one was good but uh, I think it was a bit expensive because I don't really remember the price, but I remember I paid like around 70,000 or something. Like, I bought a few more stuff from that uh, place. I bought this uh, collagen eye patches. I bought like quite a lot actually. This was the brand called Saem, I think, which is like S A E M. Also, I bought this. Uh, acne spot patches. These are the foil nail wraps uh, to remove your nail polish. I wanted to buy this because I mean I felt like it's useful especially you know like sometimes you put uh, nail polish and then you put glitter on it and like that so the glitter it's not easy to remove for me like I mean I'm really struggling so you have to put the cotton on and wait for a while and like like scratch while like try to take it off you know so this will be useful because you just put the nail polish remover here and then like you can wrap it around your finger like keep it like for a few minutes and then you can remove it easier you know so the nail polish remover like it's not gonna like evaporate or something I think I bought this in uh, Olive Young I don't really remember it says blackhead uh, clear kit and this is for the acne uh, I didn't really understand how to use it to be honest because uh, the seller woman like she wasn't really speaking English so uh, this is a problem with Korea actually like uh, they don't really speak good English so if you want to ask something you might struggle a little bit like they don't really understand you and yeah, so these are, I mean this, and this, and uh, this, and uh, what else it was, and uh, this, this is a pet Lego, and it's gonna be a cute puppy, it's gonna be a pug, so yeah, so all these, and there's more actually, and also, these are like pads for a period, you know. So all this stuff, it was actually for free and it was in a big nice packaging uh, from uh, Olive Young because I think I passed a certain amount because I spent around like, I think $200 or something. So yeah, like they gave me this, all of these like as a gift. So I was surprised actually because it was a big, like, like this big packaging. So I was like, wow, <laughs> like, first time I'm getting like this big gift as a free, you know? <laughs> so that was kind of nice, but I haven't tried any of these. But I can't wait to make this pug because it's cute, you know? This is also from Olive Young. This one, it's a Greek yogurt face mask. I mean, I don't know, it looked so cute, so I had to buy it, you know? Okay, I want to talk about this one. Uh, this is not a makeup. Uh, this is actually a sanitizer, like hand sanitizer or whatever. And this one I found it like, luckily I can say, in 7-Eleven. Uh, and this smells so good, like this smell like peach. It says uh, peach blossom, I wanna just put it on a little bit, because it smells so good. I mean, it smells amazingly peach. Like, one of the things I liked most and respect about Korea 
everything is in peach flavor or smell and I love peach and they are really good at it so yeah this is amazing you clean your hands and it smells amazing your hands are gonna smell like peach so how cool is that another cute face mask uh, this is uh, from the movie Shrek this had the baby Shrek so like his babies I mean it's so cute and the mask inside it's supposed to be like this I haven't opened it any yet because it's so cute that I actually don't want to even open it I want to keep it like this but this looks so cute and I love Shrek movies so I have to get this one and uh, there's some more from Shrek actually but things are mixed in here I'll try to find it I see it's here so yeah this is another baby Shrek and this is the Shrek himself and this is the face mask inside like it looks like Shrek face you know so I bought these like three pieces it was a bit more expensive I can say I mean it's not that expensive but I didn't want to spend big money on face mask in general so these are like maybe it was around three four thousand one it's like three to four dollar maybe like each so yeah I mean I bought uh, quite a lot of face masks, so I didn't want to throw so much money. I just wanted to buy this because it was really cute. And I actually got this one for my husband because this year I'm planning to make a birthday party for him. Uh, the theme it's going to be Shrek. So this is like one of the early birthday gifts for him. <laughs> and this one, it's the Puss in the Boots. <laughs> so yeah, the mask inside is like a cat face. This one, it's also Fiona. They do have a face mask uh, by the face of Fiona, but they have this one. So it's like a peel off, it says. Uh, it's like a face mask, I think. Peel off face mask, or it's a scrub, I don't know, but it says uh, peel off. I was thinking this is a scrub, actually. So yeah, I love Fiona. I mean, she's my type of princess, so yeah. <laughs> And uh, they also have this one uh, by the face of Shrek. I was planning to buy for my husband also, but I know he's not really using this type of things. I just want to buy it because it's cute, but <laughs> then I was like, okay, I'm not gonna buy it because I know he's not gonna use it. So yeah, I just got this one for myself. Another really cute item is this cute little monkey, chunky monkey. And then when you press it, it looks like he's blowing, but the air is actually coming from the down. So, I mean, by the look, it looks nice and it's useful because it's like it's coming actually from this down part, so it can actually dry your nails. And this was only 2001, which is like about two dollar. So it's like I don't know, it's like almost free for this kind of cute thing, you know. Anyways, this thing it's a, it's a rubber face mask. It's supposed to look like this and uh, you're supposed to open the mix inside and uh, like there's two different uh, like packaging inside like and then you have supposed to mix it and then like shake it like this and put it on on your face and wait 15 to 20 minutes it's like a rubber mask and here is another rubber mask which I think this is already ready inside so you just gonna put it on your face yeah it's like two pieces this one it's like one piece for this upper side and the second part is for this bottom side so yeah I've never tried one of these so I can't wait to try this the next is this cute uh, looking like mini makeup sponges I got these from uh, Daiso I know it doesn't look that cute inside unfortunately but from outside the packaging was so cute and it's only about like 2001 and uh, I needed to buy a makeup uh, sponge for me a uh, new one so uh, it's really cute and also this big one I got from Daiso which is less than a dollar which is 1000 Korean won and uh, the reason I got this I like the color I have a similar color makeup sponge like this but I've never used this big makeup sponge before actually I always use this mini ones but then after some time I find it hard that like how can I say sometimes you struggle to put a foundation all over your face like it takes quite a lot of time with this mini ones but I like them for traveling especially it's awesome so yeah I bought this big one for foundation actually and this egg right here it's for your makeup sponge it's also from Daiso 
and uh, if you go to Korea I really advise you to go to Daiso because you can find really cute stuff and it's it's really really cheap like it's about 1000 or 2000 won it's like one to two dollar between I mean of course there are prices higher than that sometimes you find something for five dollar or something but it's really worth the money you pay actually so I advise you to go Daiso it's cute and it's cheap these are also from Daiso it's a makeup brush it's like tiny makeup brushes or you can use this like to fix your makeup like small mistakes or uh, I actually bought this to draw a nice line for a uh, red lipstick especially red lipstick like you really need to draw a good line like kind of like contour around your lips and uh, I have makeup brushes for that but I mean it takes forever to wash it off from the makeup brush the lipstick you know so I found this one is like really useful and it has like 100 pieces inside so you can just use it once and then throw it I can use this pretty much all my life because I don't wear red lipstick all the time so yeah this is quite useful and also cheap it's like 1001 less than one dollar for a hundred piece and this one is also from Daiso uh, these are the brushes for uh, nail polish like you can draw things with it and uh, before I used to like draw so many different stuff on my nails because I love doing different arts and designs with nail polish but I kind of quit that for a long time I haven't done it so when I see this kind of stuff also this one sorry, also this like you can put dots with this part and uh, like you can put maybe smaller dots or uh, you can use it to you know like catch those uh, mini stickers and put it on your nails so yeah and this one Actually, I've seen this on the internet before, but I've never seen it in uh, real life outside. I wanted to buy something like this, but I haven't seen it before. So it was on Daiso, like you put the nail polish here and then you, just, you can scratch it out. It has a spatula and it's a mixing palette. So this is quite useful and it's, it was like 2001, these are like 1000 each, so yeah. And this is a nail mirror powder. So like you're supposed to apply after you put your nail polish and it's like giving a mirror effect it was only 1001 so it's like less than one dollar so yeah I hope it actually works and I can wait to try this one also I opened this one up uh, it's also from Daiso uh, for your uh, blackheads this part is more like straight and this part has more curviness in it so it's like you're supposed to like press it and squeeze it all out you know this is all from Daiso so I think the first step was this one like honestly I'm confused I don't really remember the steps but I think I took a picture of it that's what I remember so it's like this is the uh, callus remover it says it's like to soften your uh, under your food and uh, remove the dead skin and stuff like that and then these are uh, like food mask and this is like uh, you know the thing that you scrub it it's a, a callus remover pad it says uh, to like scrub, uh, scrub under your feet and make it smoother and this is a stick uh, it's a moisturizing stick uh, you use it after you finish all this and you put this one on to make your food uh, soften. And this is also another uh, uh, food mask. It's a peeling food mask. Uh, I bought this one from uh, Nature Republic. And uh, I used actually one of them. Uh, I used one of them when I was in Korea. And uh, I didn't keep it like long enough. But it already started burning my food like it was like like coming eat your feelings and like that so I can say it's really effective like if you keep it because she told me you have to keep it almost like one hour and I kept it like maybe 15 to 20 minutes because I don't know I was already bored like I want to go around walk or something you know like I didn't want to sit the whole time so yeah but I can say it's really effective actually so if I kept it one hour 
uh, it will remove most of the dead skin under my uh, under my face. These are also from Daiso. This is a nail glue, and this is the tweezers that you can put the like nail accessories. You can catch it with this. It's cute because I was looking for something like this and it was really cheap. And I don't remember if I bought a nail glue remover. I think I couldn't find it. So I feel like I'm gonna eat shit because I think I really need to buy a nail glue remover because once you glue this on, I don't know. Like I've never tried before, so I'm not sure if I can remove it with the normal nail polish remover. So I don't wanna risk it. This is another nail stuff from Daiso. This is for your toenails. It was really cute. It has cute teddy bears on it. You put between your toes so that it separates nicely. And I I bought yeah yeah. I bought also the mermaid version. Uh, this one has more stuff inside. It has a mini brush that you can uh, brush your nails. Next, it's this from Daiso. Honestly, I don't really know what is this at all. Like, I have no idea. Everything is written in Korean, but I'm gonna translate some stuff. So, it's for your nail. I mean, it's for your hands and nails. And this is also from Daiso. And uh, I love this one. Uh, it's for your eyes. It's These are like gel patches you put in the fri uh, fridge. It gets cold and then you put on your eyes. And I love this star shape. So, yeah. I love this one. And it was on the... 1001. I don't remember from what I bought this. Uh, hydrogel eye therapy patch, it says. Um, this is a mini mask, it says. But it's like circleish. I think it's for your eyes. I'm not really sure. Again, everything is in Korean, but I'm gonna translate it sometime before I use it. Okay, so here's another mini mask. This one has a seal on it. And it also looks so cute. This is the blue one. It's also circulation. I think these are for your eyes, but I'm not really sure. If you know, just comment and tell me. So these are um, bubble masks. And I love bubble masks. I've been buying uh, one brand. I've seen it in Korea also. I didn't know it's Korean. I believe it was Korean brand that I've been buying here in UAE. And uh, I've seen it in Korea. And that one is quite expensive actually. It's about like... Uh, 30 dirham or something, one piece, so it's like almost like, I don't know, 8, 9 dollar maybe, one piece. So these are like less than a dollar. So I got these two, because uh, I've never tried it before, but I wanted to buy two piece at least and give it a try. And I hope it's nice. And if it's nice, I'll regret that I didn't buy more actually, because it's only one dollar. Okay, so these are for food. This, These are... Uh, detox patches. It says uh, you put it under your feet and uh, it smells like lavender and it's supposed to take off your stress I think. Okay here comes the funny part. So these are breast masks. I know it sounds funny because I've never heard of it before. For me it's funny actually. So yeah it's supposed to makes your breast like moisturized and like smooth and soft and these are the nipple patches it's a nipple mask <laughs> trust me there's a mask for every single thing in korea <laughs> i mean if i see a penis mask i will i wouldn't be surprised actually but i haven't seen it <laughs> maybe there is i don't know i didn't like it that much because like when you put it on it's coming off like it's not really like sticky or it's not staying well so that's the main reason I didn't like it that much. This is a face mask for men. Uh, it's a whitening face mask. It says um, <laughs> I actually bought this for my husband in case if he wanted to give it a try like give it a try with me like have some fun uh, stay at home night. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> like uh, I know he's not a face type, uh, face mask type of person at all, but uh, I know it will be funny. I thought it would be funny, so I just got him one piece, but I believe he will not really use it. So yeah, if he doesn't, I will use it. I don't really care for men or women. I mean, it's a face mask. These are some face masks. It's like a bottle shape. 
my juicy bottle mask it says so I think I bought all the types, flavors, whatever it says don't drink on it <laughs> so it's it, the shape is like a bottle and this is a soothing mask face mask and this ducky I like it actually like she's really cute it's uh, from the line friends it's it's really popular and famous in Korea I don't really know about it uh, like except some of the videos I watched on YouTube so yeah and this is a collagen mask face mask actually I have the whole package in here and uh, this is a placenta mask placenta face mask I was kind of creeped out about this one when I first time I heard it so I was actually thinking it's a real human placenta or something because I remember there was a trend going on all over the internet like uh, people after birth like after they give birth they keep the placenta and they turn it either into a pill or like a powder or like straight itself somehow like they put it in a smoothie or something like they drink in their own placenta it's supposed to help uh, the like recovery like after birth like postpartum whatever so I don't know like what do you think about that but for me it was a bit weird and kind of sounded disgusting so yeah when I saw this I was thinking it's a human being placenta but they told me it's a red bean placenta so it's like it's like completely vegan or uh, I mean it's not an animal uh, placenta but I don't know if it's 100% uh, vegan but it's not animal I know that it's a red bean uh, placenta and this is a collagen mask uh, collagen is something big in uh, South Korea like they really care about it this is a piggy mask <laughs> it's for the blackheads uh, especially on top of your nose so I asked the same type of product uh, this one is from the mask shop I think it was the name I don't really remember so yeah the same type of packaging, the same like thing, I asked it in uh, Holika Holika and it was really expensive compared to this part, uh, this one. So yeah, I'm glad that I bought this one before. Here's another piggy nose. <laughs> I don't know why they put in the piggies all the time, but it's really cute. I love pigs. Here is another nose pack. This one has a woman on it. So this is for woman, I think, for female. And this is for men because my husband has a lot, a lot of uh, blackheads on his nose, but he doesn't let me squeeze them or something. I know squeezing is a bad thing, but sometimes I really wish to squeeze it on. So yeah, uh, at least he can, like, he's fine to use this uh, nose patches. So yeah, I bought this one for him, but if he doesn't use it, it's fine. I'll use it for myself. So yeah, this one, it says 10 days moisturizing mask. So yeah, it was a big packaging, like this big, I think. And uh, I opened it up because, yeah, like I said, I'm going to give some of these like as a gift. So Because uh, in general, when you buy a face mask in Korea, it's like in a package, at least like 10 to 20 pieces in one package. So it's a lot. These are some of the free masks I got. In South Korea, when you are just walking outside on the street, and there are some stores, people are gonna come and handle you free face mask. So yeah, these are, I got it for free. And uh, of course they'll ask you to come inside and check inside and blah blah. Especially in uh, Myeongdong, the same. Oh god, they, they really give you a headache, I'll be honest. I even bought stuff from their store and then I paid. And when I was about to leave again, like she's like she's trying to still sell things you know I mean it's done like okay I checked every single thing and I bought like what am I gonna buy like you know like I'm not gonna buy more stuff so yeah but uh, yeah they can be a bit sticky so I was trying to be nice but then I realized they really give you headaches so yeah I advise you to just take your mask and continue just say thank you and bye <laughs> um these are uh, it's a body shower and the body lotion. Uh, these are from Tony Moly. Uh, they give me as a tester, like in small packaging. So yeah, um, I have been trying a bit, but just by the color and the, by the look, I can tell you it's gonna smell amazing. 
I don't even really want to open it up. If I've seen this in the store, I don't know if there was, but I didn't see it. I can assure myself that I didn't see it. Because if I've seen it, I would definitely buy it. Because I know how good the peach is in Korea. Everything has a peach inside. It tastes good. It smells good. And it's just good. Uh, these are anti-blackhead uh, charcoal nose patches. Uh, I think I got this also from... Uh, the brand Cyan, but it says like pretty skin, so I, I don't really remember. I haven't tried yet. And these are metallic color peel off mask, it's like uh, gold. And these are from uh, this is from Daiso, it was only like 1000 won, so it's pretty cheap for a gold mask. <laughs> so I believe I don't think it's really quality, but I just want to give it a try. And this one it says black sugar, uh, perfect first serum. I'm not really sure what is this for exactly. This is from uh, Skin Food. They gave me a small tester. Um, these are nail glitters. It was really cheap in Daiso. Uh, it has like six different colors. And it's only 1,000 won, like less than a dollar. So the next two is peach, of course. My favorite flavor <laughs> in the whole world, I can say. So yeah, uh, this two is from Daiso, this was about 3,000 won and this was 2,000 won. So both together it's like less than $5. Uh, this is a body peeling and um, this is a... Uh, it has a peach perfume mist. I mean, I don't know, it smells amazing. I also got this one from Daiso. It's like a shape of peach. It's a peach hand cream and look at this cute little detail if you can see it's like a feather you know on top of the peach you know like this so yeah you lift this up and the cream under it oh it smells so good it smells like peach and it smells like Korean peach I'm gonna say because that's how the real smell of the peach in Korea. We bought like fresh uh, peaches, it was like this big in uh, Korea. It's the the most yummiest, delicious, tastiest and the most like smell amazing peaches I've ever ate in my life. I think I bought this also from Daiso, I don't really remember. It has a bath cube, it's like a bath bomb or something, I don't know, or it's just given smell and uh, it's a uh, lemon. This is another acne patches. I didn't really open it up, but it just squeezed it like this in my bag, so yeah, I haven't given it a try. There's another acne patches here, uh, Next Care. I tried some of these, but I don't know, I didn't really find it that useful, but maybe it's also about me that I'm not really sleeping that well and blah blah, so yeah. It might be helpful, but don't expect miracles. But I haven't given it a try in other brands, so let's see the other brands, maybe it's different. This one it says Bird's Nest Silk Fiber Mask. And here's some more face masks. Um, these are from uh, Daiso. These are only 500 won each. It's like less than 50 cents. This is aloe vera, cucumber and uh, green tea. These are Lime Friends. And these two, it says skin clinic mask and this is also looks like a bit medical clinical uh, mask. I got these from uh, Artbox. It was like buy one get one free so actually I took each of them one piece and then the woman went back and she brought one more extra like each one so yeah so it's like I mean these are cute emojis on top you know and this one it says First Skin Brightening Sheet Mask and this is a Water Splash Sheet Mask It says Wow Wow <laughs> Shooting Sheet Mask and this one it's doing a yoga I used to do yoga so I really love this one and this doggy is in a downward dog so yeah it's really cute This one is a Rich uh, Nourishment Sheet Mask Um, This is a Bombay Whitening Honey Mask In my last days I was looking for a whitening face mask, but um, I know it's really quite popular, but mainly I've seen many in Myeongdong, but it was a bit expensive, I think, so I didn't want to really buy it. And then later I was like, come on, you are in Korea, I have to get one of these, you know. So then uh, I found this in uh, 
La La Land or La La La, something like that, the brand. I don't really remember actually. So yeah, this was the only uh, whitening face mask I got. I haven't tried yet. I found this in 7-Eleven. Uh, uh, this is a makeup remover tissue. I got this from uh, Daiso. It was only 2001, uh, which is 60 pieces inside. It's less than two dollar and uh, it's supposed to be aloe vera inside. So yeah, uh, I actually give it a try for this one because my skin in general is kind of allergic and stuff like that. So yeah, it was so cheap and uh, it was actually worth it because I mean, it's removing your makeup nicely and it didn't really give me allergy feeling. So yeah, this is a great deal. If you know the brand Lush, uh, they are popular with their uh, solid shampoos, a solid uh, hair conditioner and uh, solid uh, like toothpaste and the mouthwash and stuff like that. And this is actually the first time I see a different brand doing a solid toothpaste like else than Lush actually because Lush is pretty expensive and I found this in South Korea. It has 60 tablets inside and this was like I don't know, it was like maybe five dollar or less. A lot, a lot cheaper than Lush. So yeah, I will definitely give it a try of this one. Because when you're traveling, especially in Europe, they are really, really restricted about liquid limits and stuff like that. So this could save you like ton of space because I have this like mini tester uh, box. I can just put like a few tablets inside and it will be enough for my one week trip or something. Um, This is... Also from Daiso, actually. It's a cute uh, hairbrush. It catches your hair a little bit because this is not covered with plastic. But still, it was cute. It's like it's small and useful, useful, especially for traveling. It's really nice. This is another face mask, but this is a gold face mask. Uh, it's a collagen. I bought this from also. I think the name it was La La Land. It's like Olive Young, I can say. And these are the cutest <laughs> makeup uh, sponges that I got from Cacao Friends. And it's actually, it has actually these emoji faces on top of the sponge itself, not from the plastic outside. So this is really cute. Okay, so these are some more uh, makeup removal wet wipes. And this is from the Sarem because uh, I bought this one just because I wanted to pass the limit which is 30,000 won just to get tax free so yeah I added this one and I thought it's good for sensitive skin because I can see like uh, chamomile and like green tea and stuff like that so yeah I hope it's really nice and this one is from uh, Tony Molly and I remember it was kind of cheap so I had to get it also. Okay, so I want to continue with these. I think this one I got from Daiso. And these two, it was from Artbox. Uh, I got these to put the makeup like in a smaller containers, uh, like foundations and creams and like that. And these are for lenses actually, but uh, I'm gonna use for my makeup because I don't use contact lenses. And this one, it's also for the lenses. Uh, it's a teddy bear. It's pink and bare and it's really cute. This is from Artbox. If you go to Artbox, you should definitely get one of these. Even if you don't use a contact lens, you can put some of your like foundation or like face cream or something for a short time of period. It will be enough, I believe. And this is also from Artbox. Uh, these are the spatulas. Actually, first time I've seen these things in Korea. It's really popular. It's only 500 won, uh, which is less than uh, 50 cent. So it has like pieces inside if you put your product like make a product inside something like this so you can like scoop it out with the help of the spatula it's like easy nice and clean so I got these nail stickers and I can't wait to try them out okay so the next is this cute little panda from uh, Tony Molly it's a powder uh, this one it's from uh, the Sam it's a heart shaped uh, lipstick so yeah you're supposed to do it like this but yeah these are the three colors next is again from Tony Moly it's this waterproof gel eyeliner and this one looks like those 
one of those historical <laughs> like pens. So yeah, it's inside is like that this piece looks like a feather. And I think this is a really cool idea. <laughs> it's like you dip it in, but there's nothing actually inside. You have to open the bottom. And I think you have to remove this. Oh, oh my oh my god. Okay, never mind. It was actually here. Nice. Nice I got tricked, nice. <laughs> So yeah, be careful when you open this. You know what, I wasted enough product, so I'm gonna take it off from my hand. And I don't wanna make it dirty, actually. I'll just show you guys like this. So yeah, and it's already strong enough. <laughs> okay, the next is this cute little bunny. I think this was also from Tony Moly. They have different type of faces and different type of color. It's not that strong, the color. I didn't like it that much. Uh, to be honest, I just bought it, like, just because it looked cute. And this is... Actually, I want to start with this one. This is my favorite noodles ever. But it's super spicy, so I can't... I cannot handle that. You know, my mouth is burning. So, yeah. If it wasn't that spicy, I would have eaten it every single day. So, this is actually... It's a cushion. It's like a foundation that you put on your face, but it's, like, inside this cute little cup. That's how it's designed. And this one, it's highlighter, but uh, it's also designed after this uh, Samyang. It's like a, I don't know, it's like a sauce packaging or something, but inside it's actually a highlighter, you can see from here. And it was a nice highlighter, I've never used highlighter before, but it looked nice, so I was like, I can use it as a eyeshadow even, I don't know. This one is from a tooth house. It's like a mini ice cream. It's like a lip tint, but in the shape of ice cream. And it's really cute, actually. <laughs> so you open it up like this. This is the color that I got. The next is from Holika Holika. The packaging, I wish you could guys touch this. It's so smooth and it says velvet. It feels like velvet. The packaging itself, it's so nicely smooth. I don't know what they used exactly. I didn't really like their shades, except this one. This is the one I saw on YouTube also. This is how it looks like. It's like reddish. I don't know where to put it on because I put that lip gloss all over. So yeah, I have to clean up and uh, make some space. But it's really cute. I mean, it, it's hard shape. This is a mini mirror that I got it from... Uh, art box it was actually sold out so this was the display one but didn't have any damages scratches or anything like that so i decided to take this i really want to find a mirror or something like this size and luckily i found it so i had to take this um this is a soap i found it in uh, 7-eleven and this is also actually uh, one of the gifts that i got from uh, uh, olive young when I shopped. So this is a scrub. The next is again from Tony Moly. It is a cute panda. It's a mascara. Panda mascara. It's in black color. There's two different types. One of them is to make your eyelashes look longer and the other one to make it like look uh, thicker. The next is that I got a recommendation on a some of my Facebook group. Uh, this is from Sam. Uh, the name is Iceland. It's a hydrating eye stick. This is for your under eyes. And uh, I heard that it's it's really awesome if you have like uh, purple under eye bags and stuff like that. And this is a avocado and sugar lip scrub from the skin food so this is like an avocado shape it's a lip scrub i don't really use a lip scrub this is gonna be my first time actually and i have to get it because it's really cute and i have really dry lips so before applying like especially red lipstick or something this is gonna be useful i can say so this one it's also from skin food it's a peach uh it's a finished powder it smells really good it smells like peach and these are like peeling pads. This is a green tea. 
on this one I think it doesn't have anything it says calming and hydration and this one it says pore care it's for your pores these are a bit expensive these are about like $20 or something like each is like about $20 this one this one was like 15 and this was like maybe $10 or something so it's like depends really I got this uh, organizing box in uh, art box I wanted this side also to be white like completely white look because they have three different types but it was sold out so I had to get this one but then I was like it's okay so at least I can see my uh, face masks inside because I bought this especially for uh, face masks so yeah these are there are some face masks that I haven't shown you so this is like squeezy green watery sheet mask I think this is like uh, it's like sprulina or something but I think it's not it says parsley and kale this is a snail mask it's all snail and this are all pearl mask it has a cute little mermaid on it she looks really cute and here are some testers that I got from uh, Nature Republic this is a ginseng royal silk uh, foam cleanser. I am actually sad that I didn't buy anything with ginseng because I mean come on like you are in Asia you are in Korea you have to get something with ginseng it's a big thing you know so yeah this is a snail solution it's a foam cleanser and this top one I have this milk and acetonin mask banana face mask uh, pure snail sheet mask uh, this brand, oh, this is a, I don't know how to read it, it's like Osiloc, I don't know, something like that. It's from Jeju, it's really famous in uh, Korea, it's a tea brand, especially for green tea and like that. So this is a green tea sheet mask. Uh, this is like one of those free sheet masks they were handling me. It's like a K-pop, and this is another snail brightening sheet mask so yeah we are almost done so the last i'm gonna show you guys uh etude house um it's also a korean brand and uh, this uh makeup sponges actually this thing is full of makeup sponges and they got me this for free like i don't know there's like hundreds of it so yeah my my husband thought that it was a popcorn or something because of the packaging actually okay so first is this concealer kit I actually used this and I kind of liked it. It has like three different colors inside and it was kind of nice. Um, these are uh, color correcting sticks. This is like green, purple, pink and orange, like yellowish orange color. This is a collagen face mask. This is a cherry blossom face mask. It's from Etude House, both of them. This is also from Etude House. It does a uh, golden... Uh, like gold lines that you can put like stickers on your nails like you can design your nail polishes and this one it's a eyeshadow brush from a tooth house it was really nice smooth and quality and the price was really nice so I have to get it and they have like open testers that you can touch it actually you can feel the smoothness and everything so I was 100% sure that I have to get this and this is a spot patch from a tooth house also I haven't tried this is a oil control pack uh, from a tooth house. I actually tried this. It was really nice. Yeah, like this. It's a compact powder. So since I like this one, I found this minion version in uh, I think this was in Olive Young. It looks so cute and it's almost the same thing. So yeah, I have to get this one. It's really cute. And this too, it's from uh, Nature Republic. This is a uh, blusher for your cheeks. I used it a little bit. It's like a pink color. It's, it's really cute, you know, the way it's designed is so cute and fluffy. And this is a stick eyeshadow. It's a shiny one, because shiny eyeshadows are really popular in Korea. And this one, it's actually a mirror. And I got this from uh, a Daiso. I think this was like $1 or something. And the last, I know this is not Korean, but uh, I wanted to add this Chanel. Yeah, I wanted to include this because 
I always go to Chanel and buy their lipstick, but they actually never handled me a cute mini bag like this. So how cute is that in uh, Korea? Because I care about this kind of stuff. So yeah, and also since you are in Korea, you have to get something free. So they gave me this uh, uh, free uh, foundation from Chanel, like a tester, like this small size. It's not my shade actually, but still like it's nice of them. So yeah, I wanted to include like how cute and nice they treating you in Chanel in uh, Korea. I wish they do the same in UAE also. So yeah. And uh, thanks for watching and I hope it, this video is like useful for some of you that I hope I could show enough. I know there are some more cute stuff but unfortunately I couldn't find it so I'll try to dig through internet and somehow I wanna order it. 